Growth is important. Our children, they want to grow. People want to grow in their faith. People want to grow in their marriage, their relationships, their friendships, their careers. Growth is important in many aspects in life. It makes us feel complete. We have achieved something. But the question that every soul should be thinking about, are they growing in Christ? Are they prepared when Jesus returns? The Bible speaks clear on God's word that we must grow in him and he will grow inside of our souls our hearts, our minds, our thoughts our actions will emulate more Christ-like behavior in the book of 2 Peter chapter 3 verse 18 Peter writes but grow in the grace in the grace and knowledge of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. We need to grow in Christ. We need to study God's word. We need to communicate through prayer on God's word. We need to fellowship with other Christians in God's word. And he also said, to him be glory, both now and forever. Glorify the Lord. See, people are putting too much thought in the world on themselves. Many are not thinking about glorifying Christ. They want the blessings. They want his love. They want his grace, his mercy. But they don't want to take part in growing spiritually in his word. It is time for you grow in Jesus. Your soul depends upon it. Your life in God's kingdom. And that should be more important than anything else in this world. The time is right now to know who God is. In the book of Philippians, chapter 4, verse 4, Paul writes, Rejoice in the Lord always. I will say it again, rejoice. Rejoicing Jesus being your Savior. Knowing that you can grow in him. live for his will and you watch your life mature in every aspect you'll see things more clearly by having the Lord deeply embedded in your life Come now while you have the chance. Don't wait until it's too late.
Don't spend time watching others, watching television, watching social media, all the things to take your eyes off Christ. Keep your eyes on the Lord and grow mentally, emotionally, spiritually. God can take care of you. He can strengthen you in this battle. But you must come to Him.